We're staying on health matters according to Non-Communicable Disease Alliance. Cervical cancer caused by the human papilloma virus is a leading cause of death among women in the Middle East and North Africa. The high mortality rates have created an urgent push to provide HPV vaccinations in many countries, including Tunisia. CGT and Adnan Shiwashi filed this report. The Tunisia Board of Family and Population is one of the state agencies in charge of providing vaccinations to women, girls, as well as to boys across the country. Our role is to provide counseling, information and care to patients who are fighting cancer. Prevention is also one of our objectives through the vaccination campaign. Dozens of civil society organizations and associations have launched a cancer awareness campaign at public hospitals to mark World Cancer Day. This International Day aims to raise awareness about cancer and to encourage its prevention, detection and treatment. It's possible to defeat cancer, but the treatment should start as early as possible. Saida is a 50-year-old cancer patient and activist. She encourages all people to opt for cancer screening. She maintains that this can help doctors find and treat several types of cancer at an early stage. I suffered for two years, but early screening saved my life. I know some women and children who died because they were diagnosed very late and doctors could not save them. We can live after a cancer treatment. Tunisia is hosting an international congress to shed light on urological cancers, lung cancer, breast cancer, colorectal cancer, and ovarian cancer. Authorities will organize workshops on anti-cancer drugs, molecular biology, and pediatric oncology on the sidelines of World Cancer Day. According to recent figures published by the Tunisian Association of Medical Oncology, between 11 and 12,000 new cases of cancer are recorded each year in the North African country. The Minister of Health has described these figures as alarming. Adnan Shawishi, CGTN, Tunis.